you would be so kind. Then you have to learn your cadences. And these are uh, from uh, Fedele Fenaroli's Regole. Uh, there, this is Robert Yerdigan's valuable edition. Um, the, the actual treatise of Fenaroli is just text. It's just handwritten text. Um, just endless, endless. Uh, and everything is... Um, all the music is just described intervallically, so it's sort of hard to imagine what it is. So Yerdigan went through and notated this. Um, and the reason cadences are so important is because structurally all music of this era is built around them. They are the, uh, the kind of the pillars, I guess, of the building. I tend to teach rule of the octave first, but I know people who teach cadences first. They teach them like the support beams of a bridge. They say cadence, 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 cadence. Now let's string some cables between those, some connecting music, and, and have a road. And they, and they teach it that way. And I think it's very valuable. In the Italian tradition, we have the simple compound and double. Simple is just that. Um, compound is um, when you have you have a suspension, and then double. So these refer to the number of events. And the reason it's called a double cadence, I wondered about this a long time. Um, the old cadences in Renaissance music are vocal. Okay, chords are a total accident. You guys all know that, right? You're an HBI, you better know that. Uh, they're a total accident, so vocal cadences are scale degree cadences. So the cantizans is 7-1. Okay? So if you do, you do it twice, that's why it's a double cadence, two cantizans cadences, okay? So um, now if I have these cadences, I can string them together with connecting music and use various modulations and, and other strategies, and I can start to put together pieces of music very, very quickly. Okay, so for example, uh, I also like to teach openers, and there are a variety of openers that appear over and over and over in music. And my favorite, of course, and your favorite... That one. Okay, I call this the page one, because it comes from page one of Wolfgang Clavieri. So... Again, uh, Christ of the Mount of Olives by Beethoven. Uh, this is. Isn't that Zadok the priest? Uh, uh, yeah. Handle, yeah, it's same, same thing. Same thing. So this opener is just everywhere, okay? And then there's other ones, but let's just use that one. So if I, if I do that, uh, I'll do it in C major, and I'll do this like in a. In a unmeasured Cooperan kind of thing. You know? Okay, that's my hello, how are you? Now I need some kind of connecting. Dominant. I'll do the opener again in the dominant. And now I'll do some connecting music. Whatever it is. And now a cadence in minor supertonic. Uh, and in that way you can just string music together. Once you have RO, rule the octave, and cadences already, you have a very powerful collection of tools. So that's the second thing. Cadences. Let's go on. Dr. Styles, if you would.